I came to the United States with my mom in the 70s. Uh, my mom wanted a greater opportunity for her children. The same immigrant story that's been part of the uh, U.S. history forever. I have an immigrant mentality and work ethics. That is, I am not afraid of working hard and long and welcome new beginnings and challenges. And as long as I could remember, uh, I had a strong desire to be a good person and to do what is right. 1992, the LA riots occur and change the direction of my religious journey. Moving from an inward focus on personal behavior and piety to an outward focus on social justice, the killing of George Floyd and protests that follow reminded me of what happened almost 30 years ago. I came to the GTU to a PhD in the Hebrew Bible in order to address in my own way the injustice faced by minority communities. It's not surprising to me that the Hebrew Bible and the religion of ancient Israel really attracted me. Ancient Israelites did not believe in the afterlife. They believed that when, when we die, life expires. And what really struck me was that even if you don't have a reward after death, you as a human being have a duty and responsibility to God and the world. To me, the GTU is a religiously diverse community, a remarkable gathering of scholars, teachers, learners, and doers, and good troublemakers who made a commitment to be in the same community of people who are very different from them. There is no place like the GTU where you have the freedom to ask questions, explore new ideas, and engage with differences while having the support and resources to do these things. It is a dynamic and caring environment that allows one's theological voice and commitment to the common good to develop and flourish sine qua non of how we you know make impact in the world and how we engage with our neighbors